Nerf Wars. It's a game played by high schoolers all across the country. Players eliminate their opponents by shooting them with a Nerf gun with the goal of winning prize money. And it's really a dangerous game. And so I would have a uh, conversation with your child. Superintendent Pat Devine of Waconia Public Schools brought it up during Monday's school board meeting. That's after six students were involved in a crash Friday night. The Carver County Sheriff's Office says three sophomores were on their way to a Nerf War site when the driver went through a stop sign and hit a vehicle with three juniors. No one was injured and authorities say none of them were engaged in Nerf Wars at the time of the crash. They're still having kind of erratic behavior of driving vehicles fast to the next site and then getting out and having their Nerf Wars. Um, so it's not safe regardless. The students in charge chose to end the game, posting to Twitter, the 2018 Waconia Nerf War is now over. Our kids were responsive, so we're happy for that. Um, and maybe it was a wake-up call. In 2015, two Lakeville teenagers were killed in a car crash while playing the game. I really thought that would put an end to the game. So to find out that it's still out there and kids still try to find a way to, to play the game, um, a little bit alarming. As parents and as, as teachers and, and school officials, we, uh, we really need to make sure that we're helping kids make good choices. Now the driver who went through the stop sign was given a ticket. Yesterday, the two seniors who organized the game met with administrators and also told them it was over. As far as the prize money, they had a poll on Twitter where a majority of the players were in favor of donating that money to a food shelf. Randy and Julie. That's a nice outcome. That's interesting, mm -hmm. Heidi, that he's saying it can be unsafe even if they have rules that say you can't play when you're driving your car. Yep, that's exactly correct. But it can make them want to speed up and go faster and take more risks. So, All right, thank you, Heidi.